Hello everyone, my name is Agent Paul of Mobile Task Force Delta 7, codename Bookkeepers, and welcome back to their SCP document review. And the SCP we'll be reviewing today is SCP-5224, Level 1 Unrestricted, Containment Class Safe, Disruption Class Dark, Risk Class Notice. Special Containment Procedures SCP-5224 is held in a waterless terrarium otherwise suited for amphibians. SCP-5224 is never to come within 100 meters of water. Frogs created by SCP-5224 must be terminated and disposed of per standard biological waste disposal methods. Description SCP-5224 is a female marsh frog, Helophylax ridebundis. It does not experience sentience, and it does not need to eat, drink, or breathe. If SCP-5224 croaks within 100 meters from a body of water, it will start to go through eutrophication, a process in which excessive growth of algae and water is caused by overt amounts of minerals and nutrients, and additional members of the order Anura, frogs, will begin to manifest within it. Said frogs will always be native to the area, and the rate of frogs produced is 5,000 per one cubic meter per second. This will continue until SCP-5224 stops croaking. After manifestation, produced frogs will instantly head towards the nearest site of plant agriculture. Upon arrival, they will begin to consume insect life at a rate that is highly damaging to the ecological balance of the region. Aside from this and their method of creation, produced frogs are non-anomalous. Incident Report 5224.1 On January 29, 2021, a peregrine falcon holding a clay pot materialized in SCP-5224's containment chamber. It dropped the pot, grabbed SCP-5224, and disappeared. Upon inspection, carvings on the pot were found to contain a message written in hieroglyphic script. Apologies for any problems my wife has caused. Sent our son to fetch her. She's been a little confused ever since the days of Babylon when she became associated with plagues instead of fertility and crops. If y'all could stop changing our domains, that'd be appreciated. With love, Kanum. Investigations into the whereabouts of SCP-5224 is ongoing. So, it is apparently a deity. It was a deity frog that was causing fertility in crops. Kind of a straightforward and safe SCP because of it is technically contained because of it's no longer in an area where it can cause the problems. It's one of those ones that it's, it's almost neutralized, but until they truly know where it went, it cannot be neutralized because it is still in technically an active SCP. But that is it for this week's document review. A fairly short one, but interesting. Thank you so much for listening or watching, and my name is Agent Paul of MTF Delta 7, and I will see you next week with another document review. Bye.